102 pounds, 50 pence for an autograph. That's a bargain. I would pay that. Oh, you did pay it, you remember. The prestigious one is here because we are about to do something truly special. Now, everyone in the world knows that the prestigious one has been seeking his very own intern. Who here would like to be the prestigious one's intern? Put your hand down, Simon. Well, Simon. I have Simon. gone through Simon. all of the applications and I have seen some of the worst, most idiotic applications one could ever imagine. But I have found some diamonds in the rough. Let's bring out my potential no, intern. Let's see who we've got. I Leighton Buzzard! Leighton Buzzard! Come on in! Hey, he's got his CD all typed out and everything! That's a bit. That boy is a dribbling idiot. Oh my god! It looks like every member of your guy. Is that Xander? So, let's start with yourself. Why do you think you would be suitable in this role? What skills oh, are good. you going to bring to being the prestigious one's intern? No, speaking. no! They are, they are booing the waistcoat, mainly. Well, I'm going to spread the word worldwide of the prestigious one. And by prestigious, I mean my dear Margaret. Well, <laughs> Margaret Thatcher was many things, but prestigious is not one of them. So we'll, we'll move on with that one. How about yourself, sir? Perhaps you're the prestigious one's intern, but you have a rather... Uh, uh, Interesting choice of attire. Explain yourself. I'll be honest with you, Joe. Hey, let him speak. I'll be honest with you, Joe. Up until about two minutes ago, I thought it was an interview to be your tag partner. <laughs> I don't really want to be your interns. I was told to dress for the job you want, know the job you've got, so... Well... You did not follow instructions, so you haven't even got the job yet, and you've earned your first disciplinary. So out you go, out you go, disciplinary corner. Oh, well, now, young man, you could be the prestigious line. one's intern. Now, why should you be the prestigious tell intern? Me tell me something where you want to be in five years. You, you tell me, why should you be my intern? You know, Joe, uh, ever since I joined this company, I've been looking for an opportunity like this. And uh, you may be the prestigious one now, but you'll always be my local hero. That is not approved interview attire. If you'd have had this, you would have got away with it. Go on, take a disciplinary rope. Go on, over there. Also, I've got one applicant left, but I've got three of you. What do you mean, three of you? Oh no, I didn't mean like that. I did not, I did not mean it like that. Really? I mean, how do you see yourself in five years? That's a motherfucking OG! Blah, blah, blah. Okay, the CV thing didn't work, so this is how we're gonna do this. This is about survival of the fittest. Only one of you could be the prestigious one's intern. The most prestigious opportunity in all of professional wrestling. Last man standing, whoever is left standing, and the first person to hand me their CV out this bucket becomes the prestigious intern. Leighton! Leighton, the match has started! Leighton! Maybe. I'd just like to see our young man get an opportunity in this business. Go on, Leighton! Go on, Leighton! Does he know what's happening? Leighton! Do you all want this young man to be my prestigious intern? I do, because I'm his reference. You completed the task, and I can't even remember your name, and what was it? Clayton, it was Clayton, wasn't it? Well, Joe, it was actually. Oh, wait, I've got one, I've got one. Actually, your name is not of immediate critical importance. Like The Rock? No, not like The Rock. You know what, you want to get cheeky with me on your first day? No problem, I'll give you your first task. You want to get cheeky? First task, go on, clean this up. Bad Leighton! Well done, Leighton! 
prepared for that kind of mental state. Get it! 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 Get it!